Hey guys, it's me, MonsterMap345 here, and today I have got a exciting new product to try, which usually, you know, um, I get a lot of Monster from the United States of America, all the flavours that we don't have over in the UK, but somehow I've actually, <clears throat> in my quest to try a new drink, I have got hold of some Monster from Vietnam. Mutant in a can. The, I've I've done a bit of bit of research and <laughs> because obviously you know you get high quality content here on this this YouTube video that reviews Monster Energy drinks, and um, I I did a bit of, did a bit of research and Monster Mutant, I think it's discontinued now in general, but it was a drink in America that was basically a soda. Monsters version of soda, their attempt to rival, you know, like the likes of Mountain Dew and, and places like that, which, sorry, brands, drinks, drinks like that, which, to be quite honest with you guys, it, that wouldn't particularly excite me, but seeing this build as an energy drink, in a can, about the size of the, you know, a normal can of tin of Red Bull, um, 330 milliliters, it just really, it really excited me, and I wanted to give it a try. So I ordered this online. <clears throat> I did, like I said, I did a bit of research. They have um, two of these drinks. One is Mutant Red Dawn, which is the exact name of the soda in America. It's in a normal, you know, like one of those wee um, soda bottles. But apart from that, it's like exactly the same name. It's the red, the red marketing, obviously, since it's named Red Dawn. But then there's also this one which doesn't have any parallels to the soda. Monster Mutant Energy Drink Gold Strike. And that will be the one that I will try today. I have low expectations because this is a drink that seems to exist only in Vietnam. It doesn't appear to come anywhere else except for countries countries in Asia. Um, but it, it's something that's, that, that, that's worth a try. It's a bit different. If I don't like it, I don't like it. Um, at least at least I've given it a shot. Now, the, the monster description here is in... It's in um, Vietnamese. I, I keep going to say Thai. and it, it, It's just because I, I went away on holiday to Thailand a, co a couple of years ago. I had the best of the best of times. So I just keep... I keep associating this with something that, that I would get in Thailand. And I'm not sure, I think it is just Vietnam, but uh, if I keep accidentally saying Thailand, that, that's why. Um, but yeah, it, it, it's all it's all in Vietnamese here, uh, I, I should say. And um, I run, run it through a translator roughly, and I've got a rough description just to give you know the, the, the general idea of it. And I'll just, I'll just read that now, and I've got this up on my computer, sorry. <coughs> right. Supplement food energy drink, Mutant Red Dawn. Strong drinks are not known for Japanese people. Mutant, making new and different ways. Sorry, two seconds. I just went off the screen there. Yep, there we go. <laughs> I'm sorry. Right, new version of refreshment. Combining impressive taste and breakthrough energy, and then the wee part, the the sack, that that part at the bottom there, there, um, it comes through the translators just sack koi koi. I don't know if that's a, a Vietnamese phrase, or or what the thing is about that. But it, it's just it's just so it's so nice to have this drink, guys. You know, from a completely different culture, um. Something you can hardly get anywhere else. I I, I know from I I know from Thailand. I, again, I wasn't as keen on energy drinks at the time, so I don't really know. I don't know for sure if 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 this is the if this is the case. But Thailand were energy drink crazy, so they were they they invented the original flavor of Red Bull. They they have Carabao, which is like a very very popular energy drink that comes from Thailand. Um. I don't know what monsters like it, or what energy drinks are like in the rest of the the rest of Vietnam, but I'd imagine this mutant is part of a a small mar you know quite a big market. But anyway, let's let's give this gold strike a try today. Enough rambling. I'm sorry, and I will open this bad boy. Okay. Mm. 
That's cool. Hmm. It smells. It smells very very sweet. Um, a, a lot of a lot of my reviews recently, I know that have been, <coughs> I've been trying these things and. I've been expecting to not like a lot of flavours and they've actually ended up being quite good so hopefully today this this will be the same because like I say it's just such an unknown for me hmm okay hmm I'm not the biggest fan in the world of that to be honest um it's very very sweet it, it, it tastes of like a, almost like what, what we have over here called cream soda which, which is really really weird to describe but it's there's a very vanilla flavor um actually almost like a bit of a red bull aftertaste if, if, if you can believe that which is just crazy because I, I wasn't expecting that um but that's that's different for sure i'm just going to take another drink here because it's it's hard to judge on first on first impressions but I get an overwhelming taste of vanilla and that's not really, it's not really for me that, but let's see. Mm. It's hard to judge. <coughs> it is hard, to, it is hard to judge because, you know, I, I, I know from... I, again, I'm so sorry, guys. If if I'm like, uh, you know, like categorizing Thailand and Vietnam as the same, but it's my only my only experience with this sort of thing is um you know is the Thai energy drinks that, that I had whenever I was over in um ba Bangkok and Hua Hin. I visited for a, a friend's wedding out there, and um so it, and again I wasn't in, as into energy drinks at the time, so I don't know. If the taste in these countries is a bit different, if people look for something, you know, a bit more, a bit, you know, you know the way. Obviously, people have different culinary tastes. I'd imagine it's the same, the same as drinks as well. It's it's very very sweet. It's very vanilla like. Um, I'm glad it's not a five hundred ml can, and obviously, of course, as well as that, there's the there's the whole fact that they have to sort of. I don't know if the mutant is based on the soda or not, but if it is, then this could be a soda drink that I'm drinking in a can. So I'm not a big fan of the Gold Strike, Mutant Gold Strike. I'll, I'll try the Red Dawn at a later date and get back to you guys, but it's just too creamy, too vanilla. Um, and again, there's that, there's that really strong aftertaste of kind of Red Bull, really, which is, which is very, very strange. But I'm so, so glad that monster are giving all these different drinks to these you know to these different markets i'm so glad that we get the chance to try these things without having to travel over to these countries thanks to the internet um and it, it's it, it's it's okay it's okay I, i'd give it like a like a one one and a half out of five which i, I know isn't great but again there's lots of factors that i don't know I barely, I can barely understand the, the, the description beyond the general gist, but I, I personally wouldn't recommend it. But anyway, thank you for putting up with me for nine minutes, everybody. I'm sorry for the, the vagueness of the review as usual, and um, I'm sorry that the, the gold strike didn't work out, but maybe the Red Dawn will be better. And again, thank you for all these different, you know, the ability to taste all these different drinks that people have and the uh, you know around this great planet that we all live on <laughs> so thank you so much everybody for checking for checking this out and i will see you again soon okay bye